Tua, obviously, 242 rushing yards is a pretty impressive number for any team. But when you have that kind of success on the ground, how much does that help the quarterback? Well, I think when you have that kind of success in the run game, it doesn't just help the quarterback. I think it helps the entire team. Um, you know, I think the O-line did a great job today. I think our running backs did a great job as well, finding the lanes that the O-line gave them, um, you know, and, and you know, picking picking their spot um, in the hole and, and getting us yards that we needed. Um, you know, I, I think that was the big reason as to why we were successful offensively today. Um, and that helped us in our passing game as well. Hey, Tua, obviously playing without Parker, Gesicki, Grant, Preston Williams for a couple of weeks as well. Um, you know, how did you do it with the guys out there today? What, how did you feel about their performance? I think all the guys did good um, from the wideouts, the slots, uh, the running backs. Uh, you know, in every week we, we go into, you know, preparing for a game, it, it's, it's always next guy up mentality, knowing that we weren't going to have Jakeem and we weren't going to have um, DP. I mean, that that's tough, but uh, you, you got to get a good groove with the guys that um, you're given. And, you know, we, we went out there and did our best to make that work. Tua, you, uh, you had a couple of rushing touchdowns, but I want to ask you about the one where you were scrambling. It looked like you put a juke move on a guy and drug another guy in. Do you, did, is that some moves, some more moves that uh, your, your teammates didn't expect from you? Yeah, well, you know, I, I try to do everything I could to to get in the end zone. Um, I, I just gotta gotta work a little bit more on some some other dance moves I got going. So, <laughs> hey, two uh, two quick questions for you. Um, how important was it for the, the third quarter for you there to to come out and direct a, a scoring drive right out of the bat? Um, the second one is as you look ahead to next week. Just what are your thoughts on you know the possibility of seeing Marcus back there um, in Vegas? I think that'd be awesome uh, seeing Marcus uh, because me and Kamu, uh, we're, we're from Hawaii. Marcus is from Hawaii. Me and Marcus went to the same high school. Uh, you know, I, I think that will be something pretty cool, something special. But, um, you know, I, I think going into the third quarter, you know, we, we wanted to start better than we did in the first first half. Um, I, I think the first half we, we did pretty well, but, you know, the decision I made down there and, the red area kind of put us back a little bit and kind of kept uh, the Patriots in the game. And, you know, that whole first half, I, I, I was drowning that that was, you know, my fault because we, we had points there and I try to force that. So, um, you know, third, third quarter and fourth quarter, second half, we, we just wanted to come out and, you know, to take what the defense gave us. And, you know, then you guys seen uh, what, what the O-line and the running backs, uh, we're doing so. So I'm wondering if you could speak to the resiliency of this team, not only given all the guys who were out today, but there were several plays that looked like they went very much in your favor. And then upon review or what have you, it was overturned. How did you manage to overcome all of that? Well, you got to have that next play mentality and then one play at a time mentality after that. Uh, so I think that's what we did as a team, uh, both uh, offense and defensively. And then you can include the special teams in there as well. Um, you know, whatever opportunity we were given, we try to make the best out of that opportunity. And, um, you know, when, when all else fails, we try to revert back to our rules and what we've gone over in practice. I think today was your sixth start, Tua. How would you assess how you played, not just today, but uh, throughout your first season? I think there's a lot of things that I need to continue to work on. Um, it's a continuing learning process for me as well. Um, you know, with going up against a Bill Belichick defense, that was a tough challenge for us offensively. Um, but uh, like I said, I think the offensive line did a tremendous job in both the run and the pass game. And then you also had the running backs, you know, doing their thing as well. Um, but you know, it's, it's after this game, we're, we're just going to enjoy it. We're moving on to the next game.